FL Studio just released their latest update 20.7 and one of the things that caught my mind was the VFX envelope plugin. And in this video I'm going to show you uh, how it looks like and how it works. Uh, I haven't been able to use it in my projects just yet. So this will be a first look video and maybe later I want to make a more in-depth video about it. But first dive into it and see how it works. So I imported a beat right here. So later on we can use that uh, to see if we can make something cool. So we have to load up the patcher. And then at the effects in the new tab, there's the VFX envelope. This is how it looks like. Uh, but before we are able to hear some sound, we have to add a synthesizer to it. And for now it only uh, allows FL Studio plugins to work with it. So we'll just pick SimSynth for example. And then we link the output of the VFX envelope to the input of the SimSynth. And now we have a sound. So let's see how it works. Uh, here I see some dots and here is a D. If you right click on the dot, you can see that this is the DK dot. So I want it to be at the start. <coughs> The S is the sustain slash loop end. And let's try how it works. In the piano roll we draw a note. And I'm gonna draw something randomly just to see how it works. If you want to have different shapes, uh, then you can right click on the dot and you can choose uh, different modes. All right, and here you can see the color. Uh, it's number one right now and it corresponds with the piano rolls color. So if we were going to make a second envelope bank, we turn this one to five so we can see the difference. Put this one to five as well. Uh, add another note. Uh, important thing is that here is the enable envelope switch. So if you put this on, then it will work. This base thing uh, basically sets the begin level of the velocity. So if you put this to zero, then when the envelope is at zero, you won't hear any sound. Cool. Uh, let's just create another one. Number nine. And you can see that it has an envelope mode and an LFO mode. So let's try the LFO mode right now. Turn it on. Then I'll just loop this note real quick. And 
And then we can change the LFO settings right here. Uh, you can also set it uh, to sync with the tempo. If you turn the line down from the LFO, then it's affecting the volume as well. So now we have three different kinds of envelopes uh, that corresponds with three different kind of colors. And now let's check out how this would sound when added to a bit. So this is pretty basic. Let's just just let's create some short notes to see how it responds. I'm just drawing in some random notes just to experiment with it. effect so just this is just an example on how to use it uh, I think it's a great plugin uh, it has endless possibilities in terms of cre creating interesting melodies and envelope curves um, so yeah, I think FL Studio did a good job uh, creating these and I can wait to test it out uh, a little more and see how I can use it as an advantage to my own productions. If you have already experimented with it and you know some cool things to do with it, uh, please share them in the comments. And for now, thanks for watching and see you in the next video. Bye bye.